In this quick tutorial, I'll show you how to use Napier's bones to multiply. What you see on your screen is what is referred to as Napier's bones or rods. And what I will do is show you how to multiply 6 times 325 using this ancient method. So here's how it works. The factor 6 gets located on the index rod, and it's found right here. Then we'll focus on the rods for 3, 2, and 5. Now as you go down each of these bones, you'll notice that we have multiples of that number. For example, here we have 3, and the multiples of 3 are 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, and so on. So let me highlight specifically at the index 6 for each of these bones. We have this block, that block, and that block. So we have three blocks. I'll create a rectangle and write down their digits. So to represent three, I have one, eight. To represent two, I have one and two. And to represent five, I have three and zero. Now using the galley method that I showed you in one of our previous videos, we will use these diagonals to help us add the numbers which will end up becoming the product of this question. So you see this diagonal line here? All of these numbers need to be added. We have 0, 0 plus nothing is 0. Moving on to this diagonal, we have 2 and 3. Adding 2 and 3 is 5. Adding 8 and 1 is 9. And 1 on its own is simply 1. So the product or the answer to this is 1950. 1950. Let's do one more for good measure. What if we wanted to multiply the number 9 times 998, for example? Again, we will locate the number 9 in the index rod and then the number 998. So we have this block, again that block, and that block. So let me rewrite that. Okay, starting with 9, we have 8 and 1. Again, another 9. And finally, the last block is 7 and 2. Remember, these are diagonals. So 2, 1 plus 7 is 8. 1 plus 8 is 9. And finally, that 8 gets written as it is. The product or the answer to 9 times 998 is 8982. And there you have it. Now you know how to multiply using Napier's bones.